And then this guy, I would probably F. And then this, this guy, Good I would shot. kill. Because okay, I don't... you gotta be specific. Anthony Dream Johnson. Oh, sorry, Anthony Dream Johnson. I'd F. What would? And Jack Murphy. No, you you flipped it. You wanted to kill him. No, I wanted to kill this guy. No, but I don't. I don't know though. Oh God! I just this the other guy was younger. Like he's better looking. The manosphere in recent like one or two years has been invaded by women. It's yeah. been invaded. Uh, it's been invaded by red pill hoes as as it's collided with mainstream. I think because these red pill hoes see all these betas, who are like very beta, naive, gullible. They want to be pandered to uh, mm -hmm. in a way like a politician would pander to to a voting demographic. So these red pill hoes, like Real Femme Skankian, Horsha, these are names I make up for them. Just Pearly thinks though is a real name for that chick. She has like a million subs now. These women are just predators who are just feeding you what you want to hear. Mm -hmm. And it's pathetic and it's sick and it needs to stop. But anyway, it's kind of a tangent I wanted to throw in there. Well, well yeah, I mean, I, I, I'll say two things to that. I mean, on one hand, 100%, it's, uh, it's a money grab on the part of a lot of these women. And I mean, look, you can see this just in the general manosphere and Twitter. Um, the when I was first came on Twitter in 2015, there was almost like no women at all. It was like if you saw a random girl who was around there, she was like, you know, she was like weird. Doesn't mean that like she was a bad person or anything. You know, maybe you're mutuals, but she was like weird. It was like a weird place for her to be. And then you kind of got to 2018, 20, you know, and and there were there were a scattered number of girls there but they were really low plot profile mostly lurkers 2019 certainly 2020 i mean it just there were so many women who started coming into the space yep and you know i'll be blunt about it a lot of them would say the exact same thing regurgitate yep. exactly what a man would say but they're going to get 3 to 5 times the engagement yes because it's sick. Yeah, it is sick, and I and I think you know this is this is a black pill statement about um, men and where men are right now, because even men in 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 the manosphere who are trying, you know, who are really, I think a lot of them truly trying to become more masculine, to get out of the longhouse, you know, to stop being a bitch. Hot girl says something, and you know, sometimes like not even like super hot you know just like cute girl something and not even that like, sometimes men smash that like button you know it's like <laughs> and and i don't want to be petty about it but can you imagine like can you imagine our grandfathers in this in this situation i mean it's it really does and, and i think in certain cases it, it gets it gets very annoying to me because you can tell that the women who are putting this stuff out there it's it's not even like they necessarily know what they're talking about. They just mm -hmm. are saying stuff that's maybe going to get attention. And, you know, this this guy needs to be a super alpha. Men aren't, you know, like, just allow me to allow me to double top down. Women. Top the women. They on it. They, <laughs> they they not only don't know what they're talking about, they don't even care. Yeah, they're just they're just saying what they're pushing, whatever pain buttons or whatever emotional buttons and these guys or whatever even ideological buttons they want to hear. You know, these hoes ain't loyal. Yeah, she's not yours. It's just your turn. $5 super chat, right? Yeah, yeah. They're, they're just pushing buttons to make money. They don't give a fuck. Yeah. These women, they're predators, and they're not like sociopaths uh, in some clinical sense, but they're sociopathic in that they really don't give a fuck. It doesn't matter to yeah. them. They're like, yeah. look at all these fucking simps. This girl, dude, just probably thinks is a five. She's a friendly five on a good day. I mean, just gross, right? She looks like Shrek's ex-wife, I call her. <laughs> she's a gross woman but these dudes simp for her to an astounding degree and it's like this is gross and she doesn't care she doesn't know anything she's some 25 year old bimbo five, a friendly five bimbo i mean it's just like just completely average and, and mediocre as you could possibly get and yet she tells these guys what they want to hear and they fucking eat it up and then they stay let me put this too they they stay stuck like a hamster or like a slave in this like pen but one thing one thing that amazes me TLA, the okay. lead attorney. Uh, you know, we got to have diversity. I'm trying okay. to think of a white one. It's not coming to my mind. I'm kidding. Uh, if it's Manosphere, it's like, okay. Ooh, uh, Anthony Dream Johnson. Who's that? 
Anthony. I'm the president of the Manosphere. Anthony, let me let me. Twenty one studios. Let me let me look. Hold on. Twenty one studios. I don't I don't know if I know. I might sometimes I know people's faces. I know. I feel you. This guy. No, what is that? Okay. He looks like a woke boy. Twenty one studios. Anthony is his middle. This is not going to age well. It's okay. Anthony. That's him. You know him. Come on. Uh, not really. Yeah, you do. I don't think I've ever He's seen a video. He's doxxed everybody in the sphere. Okay. Yeah, I don't know who that is, but I'll I'll do it. Like I'll put I'll well I'll put him in the three. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, so who else did I say? TLA. Okay. Him or <laughs> Jack Murphy. Jack Murphy. <laughs> uh, he was just on You Are Here. Jack Murphy? This guy? Yeah. Um, okay, that's... Oh, this one's... This, like my eggs. This one's easy. Um, <laughs> if, if you knew the backstory on ADJ, I think you would think otherwise. <laughs> is, is, is I don't know. Pick it. <laughs> it's here. No. Oh, my gosh. It's no, the lead DJ. attorney I would marry. Okay. Uh, um, he's He's so cute, actually. Yeah. And then... This guy, I would probably f, and then gotcha. this, this guy gotcha. I would kill because okay, I don't... you gotta be specific. Anthony Dream Johnson. I'm oh, sorry, Anthony Dream Johnson. I'd f. What? Would... And Jack Murphy. No, you f- you flipped it. You wanted to kill him. No, I wanted to kill this guy. No, but I don't. I don't know though. Oh God! I just this the other guy was younger. Like he's better looking. 